Informal residential areas at Karibib have been mushrooming in the past few years, underlining a housing problem at the town. Among those who received the 72 low-cost housing from National Housing Enterprise, NHE, is Teresia Wonzi, who has been waiting for 15 years to own a formal brick house. These houses which is standing today, it is uh, a reward or an answer of many people's prayers. Uh, some of the people's prayers they have been praying for 10 years back, 15 years back, praying for something quality, affordable, comfortable, luxury to live in. 15 families who received loans from NHE have so far moved into their housing units, while four others funded by the banks have done the same. NHE says there is a slow allocation of the houses, but by improving NHE's finances, the current situation could change. Our ambitions ultimately <clears throat> is to mobilize and appeal for more resources to NHE and is supported and justified by a sad reality in Namibia in which despite all these solid frame, policy frameworks which are in place, approximately 70% of the Namibian population still do not have access and can not afford conventional home loans, facilities offered by the financial market. Deputy Minister of Urban and Rural Development commended the investment by NHE and Town Council despite COVID-19 pandemic challenges. A decent home is critical in ensuring, restoring and maintaining a person's dignity. It is for this reason that shelter is one of the basic needs and every eligible Namibian deserves one. The government directly and through its agencies, such as the NHE and local authorities, continues to prioritize investments and the mobilization of national efforts towards the scaling up of the provision of serviced land and housing in general. The houses handed over are a mixture of one-bedroom units worth $270,000 each and two-bedroom units in the range of $290,000 to $385,000. NHE says about 100 residents are on the waiting list, but due to financial constraints experienced because of COVID-19, they are finding it hard to secure home loans at the banks. Renata Rinkura, NBC News, Karibib.